We've all heard an awful lot over the last year about mechanical ventilation in COVID patients. But did you know that we can also perform mechanical ventilation in our furry companions with severe respiratory disease? In fact, our veterinary ICU ventilators were designed for humans. And during the first lockdown last year, some of our ICU ventilators were redeployed to the NHS. In my article, Ventilating the Furry ICU Patient, in the Spring 2021 edition of Physiology News, I will be discussing pulmonary physiology with respect to mechanisms of hypoxemia and the indications for mechanical ventilation in dogs and cats. I am going to be looking at some of the similarities and some of the differences in ventilating dogs and cats compared with people, and also some of the unique challenges and the unique advantages of ventilating our furry family members.